Uh, one of the things that I've noticed being from Texas, uh, the few days are, well, it just seems like few days. It's been only about two, I guess, that we've been with you. Every day you have a, a different kind of boot on. Uh, this is a beautiful thing. Yes, this is a cream uh, leather boot. Actually, we have a big house in Hollywood called Western Costume. And uh, I've that. had yeah, and I've had a lot of uh, uh, Western outfits and boots and so forth. What do you call the ones that you had yesterday? They were came oh, up they to came uh, halfway up yeah. the thigh. Yes. Well, the French uh, last year came out with the um, hip boots. And I went to Western Costume and said, can you make them for me Western style? So they made them of a very uh, soft black leather kid, and uh, they are contoured the whole way up so that they uh, stay on the leg. Well, now, the, were they suede ones, the ones you had on the first day? Uh, the first they? day, those were the French boots, which uh -huh. are green suede, yes. but actually they're not made as, as well as the uh, Western boots are. Well, I, I couldn't help but comment on them. Something else, Carol, since I'm from Texas, uh, is this really true or is this apocryphal, the story that when you were doing the, the weather show, the crack you made about Texas? No, that's absolutely you true. You want to tell the story? <laughs> <laughs> well, yes, uh, when I was a young actress in New York and I had a great deal of difficulty getting jobs, so uh, they were um, looking for a weather girl, one of the first weather girls in New York on um, uh, the station that had its uh, offices up in the Empire State Building. It was very crowded there. So I had to get the weather and put it on the cue cards myself. And just as uh, I gave the stagehand my cue cards, a kiddie show let out. and Everybody rushed and practically knocked me down. And I got on the show. And I was so nervous anyway, since it was my first TV job, and he didn't hold up the cue cards. The man disappeared. So first of all, I made up all the degrees of the weather. <laughs> and then uh, I was supposed to fill in with, um, you know, the cold air and the hot air and so forth. And I couldn't remember that. And I remembered that there was some sort of a warm front moving up from Texas, and I very charmingly said, and there's a lot of hot air blowing in from Texas. <laughs> <laughs> and, of course, they sent me a telegram in the middle of the night, we will not require your services as of tomorrow. Must have been a Texan for a manager. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, I think making up the whole weather report didn't help.